We're from Los Angeles and I never had a yard. And so I always wanted a yard for the kids. A lot of times I try to build something and just kind of go with it. I don't really have any plans. In the 32 years we've been here, he has planted every single tree on the lot. He's grown every blade of grass. He's put every rock in this yard. He went out to the desert, collected all the lava rocks. He's done every single thing by himself. The only thing I take credit for is the flowers by the fountain. I kind of did it a color combination where I'd put like all the white chrysanthemums together and then the pink and purple and white together. It's really pretty in the fall. And I really like raised planters. <laughs> raised planters will do so much for a yard. All you have to do is gather some rocks and fill it in with dirt. Instead of getting rid of the dirt, make a planter. One of my daughters was going to get married, so I always thought it'd be cool to have her married out here, so I built a little deck out there. He went out there and built that in the middle of winter, and our oldest daughter got married back here. And we've had seven weddings back here. You know, all of a sudden, I just kind of always wanted a little bar and uh, it started out small and then I added on to it. The upstairs was added on later as kind of a bet for my kids that I wouldn't do it. And the spiral staircase is the same thing. All the Virginia creeper, he started with a small plant and it grew up to the crow's nest. Yeah, it's just kind of a, a labor of love, I guess. Somebody comes and they hang something up and we, and we sit here and have a couple drinks and everybody just visits and it's, it's my, by far, that's my favorite part of the bar. We have had a lot of events here and we've just really enjoyed, you know, our backyard.